welcome back to another episode of Rose and Gold. I'm your host, IK, and this is our lovely co-host, Dr. Ross. Everything is everything. We just got back from our class from the Waco Police Academy, and as you can see, we were enjoying ourselves a light feast before we make our way back over to Dallas to get That's back right. to the studio, work on more projects and personals.xyz. That's right, and if you don't know what the word feast means, then feast shots. Nigga, can I fight for this? So let's get into our first hot topic for today, our She's Hot Contest winner. So our first She's Hot Contest winner is Miss Corinne, Miss Corinne Fox. That's right, and Miss Corinne Fox, she was on the beat Shazam, and that's when we first witnessed her beauty. Facts are facts. But now they have other people on the beat Shazam. What are the Kellys? Yeah, Kelly Clarkson, <laughs> Kelly Riley. Kelly Ripa, any one of them. Who knows? And also, Nick Cannon. I don't know how well Nick Cannon is doing with the show, as we haven't kept up with it after Corinne and Jamie left. But, Nick, do your thing, and don't make it wild and out. Nick, you take this shit no more, man. And once again, congratulations on your win, Miss Corinne Fox. Congratulations, Miss Corinne Fox. She is a fox. Now, speaking about Miss Corinne's father, which is going to lead us into our first hot topic, Mr. Jamie Fox, with two X's. What do you mean by that? Mr. Jamie Foxx has allegedly, allegedly they say that something, there were some altercations in the hospital and we don't know if Jamie's still with us. That's the first alleged allegation. The second alleged allegation is that they're saying Jamie Foxx has been cloned. Whoa, what? He looks a little bit paler than he usually is. The nose is different. He doesn't have the tattoo on the back of his head. Here's the two videos of him playing pickleball. Um, and him on the boat. Oh, get him out of here! What are your thoughts about this, IK? I'm gonna take you one step further with saying he's paled up a little bit, saying that Jamie Foxx has turned white. Nigga, can I fight for this? And not only that, with all of the footage and videos that have been released, has everyone noticed that the videos have all been just the back of his head or the side of him, or just a front facing shot of him sitting down and not really saying anything or doing yeah. much? Boy, ain't no way, boy. Boy, ain't no way, boy. It's like they hired a double to just go in there and do a really quick stunt and then get out. Exactly, and I'm gonna have to agree with all the allegations saying that Jamie Foxx might be a clone. Because we almost don't know if this is some sort of practical joke or anything going on since, you know, allegedly, since he's releasing his new Netflix TV show called Cloning Tyrone. And that just released a few days ago. <laughs> That make your spot and senses tingle. Exactly. So, so this might be a really, really big publicity stunt. If it is, people are gonna think he is just as crazy as the weekend. We all know when the weekend did that big thing where he did all the plastic surgery around his face and people thought it was real, but it was just to advertise his music video. So we're thinking that's exactly what Jamie's doing. Yeah, we want to see Jamie Foxx do it well. So I'm here for hoping that this is part of his TV show yes. and he's going to come out, come over to the clone and say, no, I'm the real Jamie Foxx. That's right. You never know. This is our next hot topic. We're going to put the photos right here. Miss Paris Hilton just released all her photos announcing that she is the original Barbie and we have to agree. Paris Hilton is the icon. She is the Barbie. And not only that, Paris Hilton recently partnered with Mischief. Mischief just collabed with Crocs and made their new giant yellow boot, and Paris is the face of that new boot. Hold on, hold on, man. What the hell? Mischief is back at it again, doing yet another controversial thing with Crocs and big yellow boots. We knew they were going to do it after their big red boots, but Mischief is always coming back to another thing. One thing I will commend them on is Miss Paris Hilton coming back into the spotlight. Exactly. Miss Paris Hilton is actually, I like how she's taken the idea that Kanye had where he basically did a mischief of a Crocs boot. And basically, Miss Paris Hilton is running with that, partnering with mischief and Crocs. And she's doing it right because Kanye just recently released his new jackets for season nine. We're gonna put the jackets right here. jokes online because they look like the Ku Klux Klan outfits. So we don't know who's going to be buying that Kanye, but probably not a single person. 
a little bit off the medication in this one. So exactly. Kanye, take your medications and go talk to the therapist. One last thing with these boots, uh, the boots that we want to say, we're definitely going to be buying a pair as these are going to be the style trends. But for one, we don't know how much these are going to be, especially exactly. since this Paris Hilton is part of them. It might be 1000 2000 2500 Exactly. You never know. definitely raises the price whenever her name gets stamped on something. I'm rich, bitch! Especially today with Mischief, they're both going to be getting theirs. These were all of our hot topics for today as we have places to be and things to do. I mean, we'll I just there. got out of our class for the Waco Police Academy for teenagers. So, yes, continue off those off. We'll see you all in the next episode of Rose and Gold. But make sure to stay tuned for all of the hot topics. Like follow, subscribe, and share this video to all your friends and family for the new ones watching. And we'll see you on the next episode. And for all of the She's Hot winners out there, that's for you. We'll see you on the next episode. Alec Bowen. That's for you.